Welcome back guys, today's video is about the latest addition to the Philippine Air Force's fleet of aircraft, the Airbus C-295M. Now this is not just your typical transport aircraft, as this aircraft is capable of performing multiple missions at considerably low operational costs according to its manufacturer. The new Airbus C-295M acquisition of the Philippine Air Force is part of the Armed Forces of the Philippines Modernization Program. A blessing ceremony was held at the Clark Air Base in Pampanga for the new Airbus C-295 aircraft on November 11, 2019. The Airbus C-295 aircraft is a twin turboprop aircraft and is considered as a new generation tactical airlifter which conducts multi-role operations worldwide under all weather conditions. And due to its high versatility, the Airbus C-295 is capable of being reconfigured from the C-295 transport variant to other C-295 variants in back. And it's also capable of landing and taking off an unpaved runway. And here are the other C-295 reconfigurable versions. First, we have the armed and ground ISR, an intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance version with a multi-mission radar that can also be weaponized to conduct effective close air support operations. An efficient water bomber to fight forest fires with up to 7,000 liters of water or retardant. Third, we have the Persuader variant. It's reliable, long time on station in combination with its fully integrated tactical system make the C-295 Persuader variant the perfect platform for maritime patrol and anti-separating warfare missions. Fourth, we have Sigent. With complete interception of electromagnetic and communication emissions to obtain a high level of situational awareness and to generate an intelligence advantage. Fifth, we have the AEW. In its airborne early warning version, the C-295 carries a state-of-the-art ISO radar for 360-degree coverage to provide a full picture of the airspace. Sixth, we have air-to-air -air refueling. With a removable refueling kit, the C-295 can be easily transformed into an air tanker that is able to provide up to 6,000 kilograms of fuel to fixed and rotating wing receivers. Seventh, we have the VIP transport. With its palletized VIP seat modules, the C-295 brings a high level of comfort to short and unpaved airstrips in remote areas where usual VIP aircraft cannot land. And lastly, we have the medical evacuation. In its medevac configuration, the C-295 can fit up to 24 stretchers, plus 7 medical attendants, and even an intensive care platform configuration is possible. With all of these capabilities combined, this makes the Airbus C-295 a very powerful medium transport aircraft, don't you think? Sadly, most people want something with more power, firepower. Well, this aircraft was not initially made for that purpose, but considering its capabilities, in its class, it surely is very powerful, would not you say? Share your thoughts and comment down below. But before we continue, we would like to thank Airbus for the media clip used in this video and as well as the Philippine News Agency for the news updates. All links can be found at the end of this video. And if you're new to this channel, please do not forget to like, share, and subscribe. Now, the latest Airbus C-295 aircraft is the fourth C-295 aircraft operated by the Philippine Air Force. The newly acquired C-295M aircraft will begin its operational missions transporting troops, equipment, and relief goods in support of the earthquake-affected victims in Mindanao. The Philippines, being an archipelagic country close to the Pacific Ocean, regularly gets storm and typhoon visits and even earthquakes. Filipinos obviously don't want them as they cause havoc and destruction. But since we really cannot move away from the storm, our best option is to prepare for them. The government's initiative to add more transport aircraft would be a great use in this instance. Hopefully though, this would be the last time this aircraft is going to be used for that purpose. 
Anyway, how many Airbus C-295 aircraft does the Philippines need? What do you guys think? Again, share your thoughts and comment down below. And here are some promotional videos of the Airbus C-295. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. That's going to be all for now. See you again next time. Once again, this is In The Know. Thank you and thanks for watching.